It's the mat work. Lapis Stone. Lapis Stone said, hey, brand man, I have a question. How do I monetize my profile account reach on Instagram to sell albums and merch or get brand deals slash collabs? <sighs> All right, how do you monetize? I don't know if you're saying, how do I turn on a monetization feature in some way? Or are you just saying, how do I uh, get more sponsorships and things of that nature? Now, let's just go with the latter, right? If you're talking about, how do I get more sponsorships? How do I position myself from a, as a brand that people care about and want to be a part of? A lot of that comes from the aesthetic that you build out, right? Just point blank. Do you look like something that's interesting, something that's um, cohesive. It doesn't have to be professional, high quality. It needs to have a cohesive feel that a certain demographic can relate to it, right? So, because me as a company, I have a message that I need to get out to a certain demographic, right? And if you match that demographic, beautiful, right? Your aesthetic, is, you know, my demographic might require super, super high quality visuals. My demographic might actually require a lower quality look, right? A more organic feel and actually hate super high quality. So first you need to figure out who you are, what you're trying to do and accomplish. And once you do that, then you can think about companies and sponsors that want to match with that. Now, if you need any help with that, uh, actually, while I'm thinking about it, this is the perfect timing. So at our agency, Contrabrand, we actually just launched a small, you know, we're testing it, uh, the ability for artists to reach out for us, reach out to us and do an audit. So we're gonna audit people's entire web presences and pro profiles and do a diagnostics where we can show you exactly what you need to do to improve all your profiles and better yourself for brand sponsorships, companies um, to, to partner with, um, higher conversion in general, just getting an entire thing into a cohesive brand narrative story and something that's actually going to be some, uh, something that not only, like I said, gets you better conversion, but up, ups your brand sponsorship capability, right? But I'm not going to go into that deeply. If you want to check that out, www.contrabrand, like brand, man, contrabrand.agency. Check that out. Understand that if you want to position yourself for growth, all right? It's all about w understanding what you have going on. Artists, too many artists want too much without even knowing who they are, right? Without having a strong enough identity to be attractive to other people. So if your identity isn't strong, you don't know what direction you should go. Why should somebody else just see you and then choose a direction for you? There are some people where people like are like, man, I know exactly what to do with that guy. He doesn't even know what to do with himself yet. But most people, you really have to mean something to them and already exhibit something. Even if I don't know, or I mean, even if I don't think that you're for me, I should be able to say, yo, you need to meet my friend X, Y, and Z though, right? Or he will be better off if he met this guy, even if I don't know him, but I should be able to know where you belong, all right? If you don't know where you belong, don't expect other people to know that either. All right, Psst. Yo, yo, I don't know if you heard, but we hit 100,000 subscribers on YouTube and we are celebrating all month. Big part of that celebration is we're giving away 100 spots to brandmannetwork.com for only $10. That's access to exclusive content and getting helped in ways you would never get on YouTube for only $10. Amazing deal. Only $10. Brandmannetwork.com. Pause this video going over there. And if you miss out, either way it goes. We really appreciate you guys. A hundred thousand subs. That's huge. And now back to whatever I was talking about.